There are a bunch of possible congenital anomalies of the penis, but only two are clinically significant, hypospadias or epispadias and phimosis, hypospadias and epispadias. Malformation of the urethral groove and canal can create an abnormal urethral opening on either the ventral surface of the penis, hypospadias, or the dorsal surface, epispadias. Either of these may be associated with failure of normal descent of the testes and with malformations of the urinary tract. The abnormal urethral opening may be constricted, leading to urinary tract obstruction and an increased incidence of ascending urinary tract infections. Normal ejaculation may also be hampered if the orifice is near the base of the penis. Phimosis. The orifice of the prepuce is too small to permit its normal retraction. This can occur as an anomaly of development, but more often it is the result of repeated attacks of infection scarring the prepuce. This condition is important because it interferes with cleanliness. The accumulation of secretions and detritus under the prepuce predisposes to infections and carcinoma. To read more, see Robin's 9th edition, page 970.